Ready for war, it's all hands on deck. <laughs> aye, aye, <Captain. laughs> What's up YouTube, YouTube? It's your boy Danny Boy and today I'm here to take your helmet game to the next level. I'm talking about that good brain. Anyway, so we've got this helmet here. We're gonna be using a new Pro Fast helmet for this, but it works with most helmets. There's only one thing that you have to have to make sure it works. So what you need to do this upgrade, you need a lower face mask, preferably one with two straps on it, and you need a helmet, as simple as that. Now, it does not matter what make the helmet is, the only thing you need with the helmet are these little clips on the side here. So, these here. So, standard helmet. That's all you need. Good old tap. Right. right, anyway, so you've got your helmet. You want to make sure that these little clips that you've got them, okay? If you've got your helmet, you've got the clips there, that's fine, right? Keep that aside. Right, step numero uno. You want to take this and basically you want to cut along the inseam of the straps at the back uh, without damaging the main two straps that go around the side of your head. You want to keep them intact. You don't want to like cut through any of the stitching. Right, so you'll see this little seam here. You want to cut along there with a knife and be very careful with this. Again, if you're young, get an adult to do it. I don't want to be responsible for someone losing a thumb or a finger. So you want to just slowly cut along and taking the stitching out. So now you've cut along that end seam, you should have it come off like that. Now you just want to repeat what just you just did there, cut along the stitching, uh, follow the seam along the side there, and this whole bit should come separate. <laughs> carefully cut along them you should get rid of that back bit you don't need it completely pointless you should have two fully intact straps right step number two you want to separate these straps so we're just going to take them off you want to just unthread it from here <laughs> Once you've got these two straps separate, you want to make sure you attach these straps to the top side, each side, sorry, of the face mask there. So attach it to the top side, so you should have two strips looking like this. Sank, looking like that two straps either side so your nose would sit here like this you want the straps at the top top bracket right there so that's done now you're gonna to need to get that helmet that we put by earlier so you want to grab these and you want to take the clips out the side um, now it don't really matter what one you put on which side as long as it lines up uh, with the mask so take out these little clips and what you want to do now is you want to attach them to the mask um, at the ends of the strap, sorry. Right, now if you've done that right, you should have a face mask, two straps hanging off the side, and cameraman, come close, come close. You should have two ends of the straps looking like that. Two little clippy bits, all right? 
So that should be it. The whole thing done. If you've done it right, you should be able to get your helmet, get your face mask, strap for the right. Yep, yeah, that is right. Clipped into the sides. Strap for the left. Clipped into the left. And there it is. Right, okay, so once you've done those straps and you put them on, just adjust them to how like long or short you want it. Um, you should be able to just chuck the helmet on your head if you're not being an absolute mug. There you go. And then you just pull it across, find the hole on the side of the helmet, which I'm going to have no trouble all getting. There you are. And there it is. You got your lower face mask on, helmet on, not going to fall off, it's stuck there. And uh, if you ever want to take it off mid game, just press the button on the side and that's it. Stays hanging there. So I hope you guys like this tutorial. Uh, it is so good. It's the best helmet setup ever. Ever since I've had it, I've never gone back. Like there's nothing more annoying mid game than trying to get a drink of water or something and ended up having this stuck in the way. Um, and if you want to check out our last airsoft tips and tricks video, we actually have one of these tips in there for that. Um, so we thought we'd show you guys how to do it. But as always, like and subscribe and follow for more airsoft content coming soon. We should hopefully have some airsoft gameplay because we're now tier two, which means we can get back on the field and start playing again. Anyway, ooh, let us know in the comments what you think. And uh, Messi, take it away. Yeah.